This one works. I don't sell this, I'm giving it to you for free, so take it and use it because it's the best thing I've found for hand development, awareness, control development, they're prime, they're gold, man. Takadimi refers to these four pieces, these four chunks of time that we're assigning value to, essentially. Think of the phrase takadimi, takadimi. What we can do with that is accent different individual pieces of that phrase. So if you accent the first note, the first sound, ta, and not the rest, then you get takadimi, takadimi, takadimi. Which is cool, you can repeat that and it's a groove on its own. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. We can move that accent instead of being on the first, put it on the second. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. So then we put it on the third. Takadimi. Takadimi, takadimi. That's like country. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. Uh, and then you put it on me. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. Just think takadimi, just general, vague. Four things, and we apply an accent, a louder sound, to one of those four. Then we can apply it to two of those four. Like if we put the ta and the mi accented, we get takadimi, 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 takadimi. Cool. Or the middle two. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. By the way, if you don't own drumsticks, you don't need them to learn any of this. This is all stuff you can do in your head or with your hand. This is another way of drumming. You don't actually, yeah, you can tap, or you can tap open palm to inner palm. Um, that'll work out palmaris longus and different parts of the hands and wrists and arms. If you can get those fast, even doing rhythms such as a double and a double on this side. We can displace that accent all over the place and, uh, and, and that's essentially our melody is accents. That's a drummer's melody is accents. So if I'm just takadimi, 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 there's, n there's no um, Groove. Groove is assigned by accents. If I only repeat the same takadimi, 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 it's fine. It works. But like with Latin music and a lot of world music, the reason that's so groovy is because they'll put the accent on on like an offbeat 16th note. It's not as predictable, it's not as even and square. S square. Cool. Do get your get to get your get. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. Without them, we just get stagnant, da 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 da, which is excellent for practicing sticking control and things like that. But when we actually want to lay down groove, those accents are our power. They're they're the foundation of of groove altogether. They're the foundation of dance and rhythm. Our job is to enforce rhythm, not so much create it, sometimes create it, maybe we create fills, but if you're playing a soca, you want to stick to the soca groove, but you enforce those, that foundational groove so that the dancers have something to dance to. I wonder if you can hear the highway. What I love about recording in here is this quality of sound. It just kind of muffles everything nicely. Nothing can really reverb that well. I heard somebody recording, they recorded podcasts in their car and they suggested that if you're, if you don't own a studio or a good place to put, put up soundproofing or just even don't want to bother with it. If you have a vehicle, put a video camera in there and a, or a microphone in there and just record that way. It's perfect. Perfect. So Takadimi, um, just going back and forth between right and left. Doesn't matter which hand goes first. If you're right or left-handed, we'll just go boom, 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 boom and throw an accent, which is a louder hit, onto one of those. I use this app called Pro Metronome. Um, I, they're not paying me to do this. I like them, they're good. 
84 beats per minute. One, two, three, four. You can get incredibly creative with these. Instead of an accent, make it a flam. Instead of an accent, make it a double. That's you. That's what that's what you are. I should take off this jacket because it makes noise. So I'm going to go through each of these exercises slow. The the first bar, the takadimi, takadimi, make that the home, make that the reference point that we will go back to between every bar. Or maybe I'll put a thing right here. So we go one, two, one, three, one, four, one. One accent for now at 90 beats per minute. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. Now I'm back to one. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. Back at one. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. Back at one. That's the whole thing. Let's do that. Uh, 90 beats per minute. Two accents. Takadimi, 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 takadimi. Maybe don't count that whole thing out loud or do count it out loud. Yeah, yeah, count it out loud. Um, but don't run out of breath. That was exhausting. That was hard. Then you increase the tempo and this becomes pretty cool. Make it a bass drum, or a double bass drum, or a double hi-hat with your foot, or your toms. You can spread this across the drum set, or across your limbs. Every day increase the tempo by like five beats per minute, by small increments, and just slowly progress. Slowly progress, and but always push yourself. Challenge yourself. Grow. There's no reason not to. Unrelated, if you're somebody that's looking to start this kind of thing, like teaching drums online, or, or teaching anything online, or whatever, if you're looking to start creating something, do it. Don't wait, don't... I know I'm waiting for proper audio gear and for, for drum recording, but that aside, start the project. Um, start, start it now. Start with what you have, where you are, with what you have. I've come to a room in the library and it's just not occupied. I didn't book it, I just walked in and pushed record, so that's effective. That works. You can do it. You don't have to wait for the optimal opportunity. Don't bother. Just start. Make it rough. It'll, uh, in the long run, you won't even notice those first few videos. I'll, I'll be thrilled if somebody watches these in two years. But by then, I'll have two years of experience recording this stuff. So, choppy at first, effective in the long run. Do it! Do it.